show your support, like, share and subscribe. There you go, first of the month, we're into September already. <laughs> yes, goodbye August, yes. goodbye summer. What happened to August? Yeah, it was a bit like that, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, it feels like we had a heat wave and it's gone and the start of the football season was like, you know, 10 minutes ago and it was yep. July at some point and I had a holiday but it's gone. <laughs> yeah, and then we kind of were like ships in the night. So you came back, I went, yeah. I think that day. Yeah, actually, pretty much. And yeah, ah. Yeah. I, and then yeah. now all we seem to do is spend our lives at work. Yes, very much so. Ah, oh, work. Ah, fun, fun, oh, fun, well. fun, fun, fun. If all things, you know, go well, maybe I'll have a more local sort of a uh, local aspect to work, but we shall see. Well, I mean, I was pretty much guaranteed that this YouTube lark was a shoe in for earning money. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear! How have you been since we last uh, last spoke? Um, yeah, I can't even remember when that was. That was feels like. Blooming ages ago, yeah, to be honest. It must have been. Did, um, we, did we pre do a lot? I can't remember now. We did, yeah, because you were going and or you were coming back and I was going. Oh yeah. And you weren't around, and then I wasn't going to be around. We kind of had to pre do. We did sort of two at once, almost again. Yeah. It's these damn holidays. <laughs> it is damn holidays. It's these damn holidays getting in the way of this gubbins. In the way of videos. I know. Inconsiderate holidays. Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. It's kind of allowed... Well, not allowed, but it's kind of then meant that I've kind of dropped the ball again. Yeah, I think... It, it sounded like, from what I can see from our own personal social media accounts, or the socials, as young people call them. I don't. I'm not young. No, um, well, I'm even less young. Yeah, <laughs> true. <laughs> um, it sounds like we both had very hectic week or even like fortnights, like work-wise. Yeah. yeah. Not, not you know, bad and stressful. Well, maybe at times, but just long, long days. Time-consuming. Yeah. 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 And then when you need to kind of set time aside to record or write bits that you plan on doing and then editing stuff. It's yeah. just, yeah, this week, just... I had all the intention in the world of starting as soon as I came back from holiday and then because I haven't been back at the flat either, Yeah. it's just the week's disappeared. So this is kind of going to be in the middle of a bit of a bumper weekend of uploads for me. Yeah, that's I'd, fair enough. I've kind of done a bit more Donkey Kong gameplay on the SNES oh, okay. which went out yesterday as in Saturday cool. and then there was an earlier video today on the channel another kind of booking wrestling storyline video cool and then obviously tomorrow we have the culmination of the Mario Kart we do the final the final 2-2 two, two. it is I mean, Desmond yeah I mean we know who won do we? well I, I forgot. Do we, or we has, it, it, has it happened yet? Maybe it hasn't happened yet. Oh, yeah, it hasn't happened. Yeah, that's the point. We haven't recorded till it yet. Till it's uploaded and out there, it's not happening. Yes, exactly. It, 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 and all these things happen five minutes before you see them appear on your uh, phone screens. Yeah, contrary to what I just said about the writing and the, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and the recording and the editing, it just, yeah, we just stick a camera in front of us and, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everything I do, uh, video-wise, I record them an hour before. Yeah. And to be honest, I did kind of get into that thing of, oh, I need to do a video for tonight. Uh, this? <laughs> I've done <laughs> that. to get out yeah. of that habit. <laughs> I've done that before with Pokemon trailers, but as you can tell by the recent ones, I gave up. <laughs> the first, yeah. The, yeah, the very first Sword and Shield trailer was like, right, need to get home, need to do this. And yeah. I got something up by nine o'clock that evening, and I was very happy with myself. But the rest, nah, it's all right. Just fall <laughs> down do. the wayside. Yeah. Yeah, they'll do. Oh, well. Fair enough. <laughs> what game are you playing at the moment, sir, if there is a specific one? Oh, um... I don't, well, mean, yeah, I don't mean right this second, that'd be rude, but... Uh, <laughs> right right now, while I'm ignoring you. Um, yes. Well, because I've been on Holly Bobs, Holly Bobs. Um, I resurrected my PS Vita. Oh, lovely. 
and I decided to play an old PlayStation 1 classic, a game that I go back to quite regularly, Final Fantasy IX. Oh, okay. Which is probably still my favourite of the entire lot. Yeah, I remember you saying that before. I don't know if it was via emails at work or on the, a podcast. Possibly. But yeah, it yeah. was... Yeah. I think... Is it yeah. Final Fantasy X's renowned to be the best one? But Seven. Seven. Oh, damn. So close. The one they're doing a remake of. Yes. Are you going yeah, to be purchasing seven. that one? Uh, very much so, yes. Fair definitely. enough. Abso definitely. Abso yes. definitely. Absolutely. 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 Yes. As Nid Flanders would say. Oh no, that was Rimmer, I think. Oh, okay. Oh. Absolutely dootly. They'd, they'd both get on. They'd both get on well, let's be honest. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> it's difficult oh. for Flanders to not get on with anyone. <laughs> oh well. Yeah. What yeah. about yourself, sir? Um, not too many games this week, to be honest. I've really not had much time to play games. Oh, I've no, done, that's not yeah. fair. I've done the odd sort of hour on... Uh, uh, Alpha Sapphire on the 3DS mm -hmm. but uh, as per my uncle's instruction I'm currently literally as we speak downloading Dragon Quest 11 demo oh ok because yeah, he says it's um, 10 hours long basically he's, well, he's what spent the 10, demo? Yeah, yeah he spent 10 hours on the demo wow so and he's uh, usually got if he's listening thank you very much Adrian um, <laughs> he's usually got a good recommendation track record for games so uh, ah, is that a Switch game? it is yeah well I'm downloading it on mm. the Switch I assume it's a Nintendo thing yeah ooh ok I might download that as well yeah. 10 Dra hours full of yeah. demo Dragon Quest 11 mm, ok so yeah by the time we next do a podcast I may have played a bit of that so yes ooh nice yes but generally fine I've um I, I've risked it today I've uh I've done an audio uh, an audio based risk and I have opened the window. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> it's way too hot <laughs> in this room right now to have that closed and the door shut. Uh, I can't hear anything in the background. So Perfect. You're fine. Lovely. Yeah. There's not much going on today outside. So that's good. I tell so yeah. Bike revs. Exactly. That then I'll shut the window. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The um, I, I'd open my um, room door. However. My dad and brother are downstairs, and in five minutes recording time, we'll be listening to the Newcastle Watford game. And if they score, they'll shout really loud. So, who Watford? <laughs> yeah, when they <laughs> score. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So either way, I'm like, right, something's going to have to give because I can't okay, sit in a okay. in a hot box. Yeah. Yeah. So if anything, I was just what I'd say that now in case any weird sounds crop up. That will be them, yes? Yes, that will either be them shouting or a sound outside. <laughs> but it's generally, okay, okay. generally a quiet day. Nice nice day. Hmm. It's a nice Sunday at half past four, isn't it? Because we you know, record these just yeah, before we Yeah, just before these go up, uh, go up uh, <laughs> online, yeah. Exactly. That's exactly how they work. Oh, well. Oh, oh. Shall, shall, I, shall I crack on with my little segment? Yes, what is your offering, sir? Well, what I was going to offer was... Um, my opinions and first thoughts on the mobile game Pokemon Masters. Okay. However, <laughs> however, um, for, well, sort of coincidences came into play. But firstly, I went to download it on my um, Samsung Galaxy A3, and it said uh, my phone is not compatible with this with this app or whatever it was called. So I was like, oh, because oh, okay. it's super old. Apparently so, yeah. However, oh. you know, this is all in the same day that I got a text from EE saying um, you've been specially selected to update your thing uh, a month, you know, your contract a month early at 25% off. To redeem this offer, go visit la 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 la. So I redeemed the offer and I've got a new phone so I might do that in two weeks time let you know my thoughts because then I would have had oh, okay. a whole fortnight right to play the game. It's genuinely cool. meant to be really... I've had four people separately message me tell me to get it or ask for a friend code and tell me that it's a fantastic game so mm. must be good. I'll give it a go. In However, game. Yes. So, la very last minute <laughs> changed <laughs> my plan. Um, this is something I plan to do a video of almost like when I started doing the channel two years ago it's just something I've not I've tried to go back to it and you, you know so I just so every time I'm sort of 
scripting-ish or writing notes. I'm just thinking, it's not quite there. It's not quite right. Okay. And that is just going through... Um, well, basically, people are saying that Pokemon designs are going really bad. And they're running out of ideas at Game Freak. Right. Things like a, an ice cream or a rubbish bag, I can sort of understand. <laughs> <laughs> However, I'm just thinking, well, if some of the Generation 1 Pokemon were released nowadays, what ones would people think were terrible anyway? So which ones have got, like, the Generation 1, cut, like, you know, uh, invisibility cloak, if you want, you know, for want of a better word? You know, what ones... Are masked oh, by see. Gen One nostalgia that would be yes. terrible if they were out nowadays. Well, I mean, just thinking, there's a lot that are just like it's just a an animal. Yeah, I think a good one for that is probably Goldine Seeking. They're literally just goldfish with yeah. with a horn on them. That that's well, it. <laughs> Ry Rhyhorn is just a rhino. Yeah, but yeah, well, I I think Rhyhorn would have come when. Um, Rhydon was the first Pokemon ever created. So I just think then they just thought, well, what can we do that can be an evolution before it? And then they just slapped together Rhyhorn. Oh, uh, okay. I don't mind Rhyhorn, though. That's fine. I'm all right with that. Yeah. That can I stay. mean, I don't, I don't mind, like, Rattata. It's just a rat. It's Okay, yeah, yeah it's a thing. Oh, but it's a rat, but purple. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I... The one one of the ones I've got on my list, apart from Goldine and Seeking, one of the ones I've got on my list are Voltorb and Electrode. Yeah. Like, if you released Voltorb now, not everyone would go, what on earth are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> this is just a Pokeball with a face. Like, but that was yeah. the point, wasn't it? Yeah, that was the point back then, and it was fine. But now that we're getting more intricate designs... And uh, the artwork is getting very more fine-tuned and a bit more colourful. If they just released a Pokeball with a yeah. face that explodes, I don't think people would go to it as much as possible. Yeah, true. True. Yeah. Similarly, Mr. Mime. <laughs> I mean, if you discount its appearance in Detective Pikachu, because that was very funny. <laughs> that was funny. If it didn't exist at that point and it was getting introduced now, I honestly think people would be like, what on earth are you doing? A mime artist clown? I don't understand. I, je I mm. really don't think people would get on board. It's a weird one. I've got one that's come to mind that's worse. Yeah? Jinx. That was literally le next on my list. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. I've never liked that design. I've never liked the idea of the Pokemon anyway. Yeah. No, I've I've not liked that design at all. <laughs> Even with a purple <laughs> face, it doesn't. Yeah. Uh, it's based on a Japanese fashion. Oh, is it? Yeah, I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head, and I feel really bad that I don't. But it's just based off of a Japanese fashion, and I just don't understand. No. Can I, also, similarly, okay, if Magnemite was introduced, fine. Magnemite, that makes, you know, it's using magnetic fields, it's electric type, it's, you know, it's, yeah, I'm alright with that. Mm -hmm. And then if you found out that it just evolved into essentially three Magnemites put together. <laughs> yeah. I think people would be like, okay, you're taking the piggy now. That's just... <laughs> yeah, that that is lazy in, in the same way as a Dug Trio. Yeah, I've got Magneton slash Dug Trio in the same sort of ballpark yeah. on that one. Yeah, that's, that's just, it, it, there's no... They, you might as well just go, here is a Squirtle, and here is a slightly, like, three-headed one. Three-headed Squirtle. Yeah, just to make, it's like, what? I mean, for Doduo and Dodrio, I can understand that one. That's all right. I guess so. I mean, it, it, they're not the best designs, but in terms of having three of heads of something, it, it follows its own design because it starts with two heads anyway. True, yes. And then the three heads themselves have got different personalities. I think it's joy, anger, and sorrow. Yeah. If you look at their faces, they are genuinely like, you know, one's sort of happy, one's really angry, and one looks sad. And I like yeah, that. That's good. They've got different, yeah, aspects to Yeah, them. that's good. I like that. However, Magneton Dog Trio is just three of the one before, and it doesn't make sense. Mm. It doesn't make sense at all. <laughs> Don't like it. No. Oh. 
but anyway, yeah. <laughs> um, oh, there's another one in my head then. What was it? I don't care. Uh, yeah, I think another one I got on my list is Liquor Tongue. Yeah. People have gone. People. It, liquor Tongue evolves in Generation Four into a slightly bigger Liquor Tongue. That's Ooh. that's it, pretty much. And people do not like it. <laughs> So well, I've I, never liked yeah. Licky Tongue anyway. Exactly, I can imagine. If Licky Tongue came out nowadays, people, I just, I really don't, everyone would look at it like, this is just ridiculous, how on a, stop, stop wasting slots of a Pokedex on these things. <laughs> <laughs> you know? It's almost like they came up with the pun name. Yeah. And were like, right, how do we design something that kind of works with this name that we've just made up, rather than the other way round of, here's a cool design thing, now what are we going to call it? Yeah. And in Generation 1, Lickitung could not learn lick. Yeah. Yep. The Lickitung, the what? licking Pokemon, could not learn lick. Yep. The move that, lick. That, what? Th- what? Yep. So the only saving grace of its entire design in Generation 1 didn't matter anyway because it's just... It couldn't actually use the oh. ability. Excellent. <sighs> I'm getting annoyed now. Why am I getting annoyed? I like Pokemon. They're all great. <laughs> no, I'm happy that all these Pokemon exist. <laughs> However, if, yeah, if they came out now, they'd be ridiculous. The only other one I've got on here, which I actually now I've changed my mind, but I'm going to say it anyway because it's there, is Ditto. I don't know how people would take the Ditto now. Hmm. Exactly. I think I think if Ditto came out, it would be a real sort of Marmite Pokemon. I think people would be like. What a fantastic idea. This is really, really good. I like it. And others would be like, this is just a blob that can be anything you want. Yeah, it's a kind of a... We didn't have any... We kind of had the idea of a copycat one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so we made its design as boring as possible when it always becomes something else. Exactly. So I do not think... That, yeah, I, I... I would like it. <laughs> but mm. I don't know if anyone else would. And I would find it weird that it was a normal type if I would consider transforming to be more of a psychic thing. Yeah, I guess so. But oh well. Mm. Yeah, um, I've not got too many more on my list. I can't really think of any off the top of my head either. But yeah, I do think there's a lot of Generation 1 Pokemon out there that are sort of padded with bubble wrap because they're in Generation 1. However, maybe... Yeah. They're just bad. <laughs> bad designs. <laughs> <laughs> I think designs have got better, if anything. So. They've certainly got a lot more imaginative because uh, taking aside, as I said earlier, the, the ones that are possibly bad designs are the ones that are just, it's an animal. Yeah. It's, it's a thing, uh, therefore we're going to make it a Pokemon. Yeah, exactly. And and so they've kind of had to go down the route of, mind you, having said that, they are still doing that because they've got a sheep. <laughs> yeah, they have literally just got a sheep. It, it's just a sheep. It is just a sheep. I want to know what yeah. it evolves into because so far it's just a sheep. Probably a ram. Yeah, I would, yeah, I'd say so. Or a goat. No, that, yeah, no. That just wouldn't, no, because there's probably a separate goat Pokemon. There is actually, yeah. <laughs> Oh, was there? Yeah, Generation 6. Go Goat. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Yeah, uh, well, that was that was pretty much all I had. Hmm. I do just think there's a few out there that if they were released now for Generation 8, people would be like, um... What uh, is this? Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, well. Hmm. This seems like a perfect ideas in the comments below yeah thing. if anyone else can think of any generation one pokemon that they think would be a bit of a would have a, a mixed reaction nowadays mm. that's the best way of putting it yeah then do or let us know quite a negative reaction yeah like a voltorb because <laughs> what the hell is it's just a pokeball yes exactly see yeah all that do let us know yes in the comments below exactly <laughs> Anyway, sir, that's me done. How brainy are you feeling? How brainy am I feeling? I, well, <laughs> How brainy are you feeling? Oh, I suppose right now I should be in the... It, I'm going to say 60%. 60%? 60%. Yeah. 
60%. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I have a 10 question quiz for you. All right. All with four multiple choice per possible answers. Oh, Christ. And I I was 80% clever yesterday when I tried this. Oh, okay. So let's see if you're 90 <laughs> or 100% clever. <laughs> no pressure then. No, not at all. No, no, no. <laughs> all right, then I'll, I'll give it a go. It's it's very general. I didn't write it. I found it. Yeah. Hence why, obviously, I could do the quiz myself. Otherwise, I would have got 100%, wouldn't I? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> bit, bit rubbish about getting my own questions wrong. Um, it's kind of across the board. There's various uh, bits and pieces um from kind of newer games older games nintendo sony xbox okay everything so let's see how you get on with question what i'll do is i'll get your answers and then we'll go through them at the end and see what your score was okay cool all right oh, Number one. oh so i'm not going to know if i was right or wrong not until the end oh no. okay <laughs> now just to ramp up that pressure oh good <laughs> <laughs> right Question number one. In in Uncharted 4, yeah. familiar with that game? I know of it. I know it exists. Okay. Which PlayStation 1 title does Nathan Drake play? In Uncharted 4, right, okay. Yes. Your four possible answers are Tomb Raider, Final Fantasy VII, <clears throat> Crash Bandicoot, and Mortal Kombat. Okay. What, so he's playing a game in the game? He, yes. Okay. And I think, correct me if I'm wrong here, people listening, I think you can, once gameplay starts up, you can opt to actually play the game within the game yourself. Oh, And okay. play sort of the beginning segment. Okay. Uh, oh, Christ. <laughs> <laughs> can I get the choices again? Tomb Raider. Right. Final Fantasy VII. Okay. Crash Bandicoot. Yeah. Mortal Kombat. I'll go with Final Fantasy VII, but this is a guess. Okay, you're going with that. Next question. How many Power Stars can you collect oh. in Super Mario 64? Oh, I know this. <laughs> <laughs> I right. <think. laughs> the, the answers are 100. Yeah. 120 yeah 110 or 101 oh, I thought I knew this <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna say 140 did I am wrong well well damn or or e the wrong answer <laughs> I'll go with it no um oh I really want to get this right <laughs> I don't know oh. I want to say 100 or 101. Oh, I, I just... Am I going to go with that? I don't know, are you? <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to regret it. But I'll, okay, I'm going to go with 101 and I'm going to regret it. Okay. Number three. In what year was the first game in the Halo series released? Right, okay. 2002, 2003, 2001, or 2000? I don't know. This is an Xbox <laughs> thing. It Yes. Hmm. Xbox was... Was it earlier? Hmm. I have absolutely no idea, so I'm going to go 2003 as okay. a guess. As another guess. I've probably not got anything right. Number four. Who features on the cover of UFC 2 alongside Ronda Rousey? Okay. Conor is McGregor. Is this the game that's coming out soon? No, no, this is a very old game. Uh, oh, okay. I'll show you the cover if you like. Can you see that? Vaguely, that's right, the okay, cover. yeah. Yeah. And you want it's to know who enough. the shaded character I is. I want to know who the greyed out person is, yeah. Conor, okay. Conor McGregor, Sage Northcutt. <laughs> you have to say that carefully. <laughs> <laughs> Jose Aldo. 
or Brock Lesnar? I've only heard of Conor McGregor. So I'm going to say Conor McGregor. You're going to say Conor McGregor. Okie dokie. Question number five. What is the highest selling home console of all time? Oh, okay. Atari 2600. Yeah. Xbox 360. Right. PlayStation 2. Nintendo right. Wii. Oh, I really want to say Nintendo Wii. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I think there was a point where it was. No, it can't have been. <laughs> no, PS2. 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 It's got, got to have been PS2. I was that generation. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I asked a question vaguely around this topic in a quiz before. Yeah, I think so as well. It seems to have stuck in my mind. Okay. In The Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker... Oh, I want to buy how, this. <laughs> ha, how many Triforce, Triforce shards? Yeah. It T R I F O C E is written here, but I have a feeling it might be Triforce, and it's just a typo. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, how many of those shards do you have to collect? Three, eight, six, or nine? I was going to say three. So I'm I'm sort of weird that it's sort of weird that that's come up. <laughs> Or 140. Cause it's, and also because it's, it's try. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say try. Uh, yeah, three. three. You're going to say three with the try. Yeah. Okie dokie. I still keep thinking of those bloody power stars. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm thinking of the DS one, which is 104, 150, so I'm getting myself confused now. Oh, uh, you're mixing your games up. Yeah, I think I know what the right answer is as well, but we'll go to that. <laughs> Okie dokie. I've, I've set my answer now, so... Yeah, uh, three for that one. I'm sure it's three. Three for that one. I want to buy. Dokey. I want to buy this game. That's like next on my list of retro what, games. What Mario sixty four? No, well that too. But um, uh, Wind Waker. Oh, Wind Waker. Yeah. Yeah. For game Good call. Cube. Good call. Um, da, 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 da. Right, number seven. Where was I? What console was the first Final Fantasy game released on? Oh wow. Sega Mega Drive. Yeah. Nintendo Entertainment System. Okay. Xbox. Yeah. PlayStation. Ooh. PlayStation was my gut instinct. But I, it can't be. It can't be. <laughs> I just want to double check something. Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, bear with me a second. Sorry, I'm typing. I should have done this beforehand, really. That's quite all right. I'll have a think in the meantime. Okay. I don't think it can't be. No, it can't be PlayStation. It can't be. That's too late, PlayStation. Do you have any vague idea how long... Okay, no, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah, no, ignore ignore me doing needing to check. Um, oh. Do you have any vague idea how old the series is? 90s? I'm going to say mid-90s. Okie dokie. So in that case, it would probably be Nintendo Entertainment. I'm going to go in like that one, NES. The NES? Yeah. That Okey seems dokey. the logical answer. <laughs> Fair enough. We'll just say the, the NES was around in the 80s more. Oh, okay, was it? Oh, damn, I'm thinking yeah. of SNES, aren't I? Oh, well, I've logged my answer. <laughs> I've logged it. It's done. Fair enough. Oh, here's one. Overwatch question. Did you play oh. any Overwatch? No. <laughs> no, because you're not 12. No. Nope. <laughs> um, in Overwatch, what was Devar's former profession? This is going to be a shot in the dark. Yeah. Okay. That's, um, I, I'm presuming this is Devar here. Right. Can you okay. see that? Well, she's not in like a postman's uniform or anything, so I'm out of idea. <laughs> she's not dressed <laughs> as a that? co-op representative. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. She, is she a professional skateboarder? Right. Professional gamer, professional footballer, or professional wrestler? Right. I'm going to say professional skateboarder because it's a massive guess. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Good call. <laughs> and I will not Question be. Num- I will not feel bad if I get that one wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Nine. In the Metroid series, what is the name of the main protagonist? Right. Okay. <laughs> Go on then. Solid Snake. <laughs> Seamus Morgan. Yeah. Samus Aran. <laughs> or Sephiroth. It was. It is Samus Aran. I know that one. <laughs> wow. Boom. I've, I've not ventured into Metroid much, but the one time I did, that's the name I recognise. Okie dokie. Samus Aran. That was the quickest boom. Done. Yes. I feel that's Excellent. the only one I'm confident on. <laughs> I think you'll get this one, to be honest. Is it Pokemon? Uh, no. Oh. Who is the creator of the Super Mario Bros. series? Oh, okay. Shigeru Miyamoto, Hideo Kojima, Ralph Baer, or Nolan Bushnell? I want to say... Um... Shigeru Miyamoto, but uh, I'm now questioning everything I've ever done. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it's got to be Shigeru Miyamoto. It's got okay, to be. Okay, okay. Right. He made there Mario. No he questions made left. Mario. <laughs> Let's go right back up to the top. By the way, if I get that one wrong, I'm Pokey Pidge is going to finish at the end of September with that British guy. <laughs> 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 and we'll both be in the pub. <laughs> we'll both be in the, in the knackers, yeah. yeah. Right. Question one, the Uncharted question. The game was Crash Bandicoot. Oh, was it? Oh, I was going to say that. Yes. Damn. They were both made by the same developers, Naughty Dog. Oh, I didn't know it was so Naughty they Dog. Put, yeah, they put their own game in their own game. Oh, okay. Well, to be fair, if you said it was Naughty Dog, I would have understood. <laughs> I would have got it really yeah. easy. Yeah. Oh, okay. The... Should have been Jack and Baxter. Yeah, could have been. Great game. Carry on, sorry. <laughs> Uh, number two, right, you wanted to say 140 to these power stars, didn't you? Yeah, I think now it's 120, isn't it? Yes, it is. Damn! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so annoyed. <laughs> I should have got that. Ah. Uh, oh. Knee mind. Okay, knee well, mind. no, that, no, that's, no, it's done. What's done is done. It is done. Right. Halo question. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what? Uh, I got this one wrong. This was one of the ones I got wrong. Uh, I'm afraid you got it wrong as well. Yep, that's fine. 2001. I'm happy. I didn't realise the Xbox was around then. I See, I thought it was about 2002, 2003. Yeah, I thought that as well. Mm. Oh, well but then I've I'm never owned an Xbox, wrong. so... Yeah, never owned an Xbox. Neither have I. UFC 2 cover people. Right. Conor McGregor is the correct answer. I vaguely remember seeing him on a cover of a game, so it must have been that. Yeah, I think he probably was on the cover of the first one as well, yeah. we thought. But yes, that is him. So that Lovely. is one to you. Highest selling co- home console? Definitely the PlayStation 2, yeah. yes. I wanted to I say think the it Wii, still but is. yeah, no, it is. <laughs> yeah. Ah, now this, this question is bloody stupid. <laughs> right. Legend of Zelda... Triforce shards or whatever they're called. Yeah. I said three as well. Is it's eight. What? Yeah. Damn. It's okay. not three or six or nine. You know, numbers relating to three. Yeah. No, it's eight. Oh, what okay. What the damn hell? Well, I'll buy the game and let you know how ridiculous that is. Fair enough. Uh, Final Fantasy question. Okay. Now, you got your Nintendos mixed up. Ah, oh, did I? But you still got the right answer. Oh, did I? Oh, brilliant. <laughs> yes, because the first Final Fantasy game came out in 1987. Jeez, Louise Christ. Yes. Okay, wow. It's 32 years old. That's insane. It is, rather. Yeah. Yes. So that's one for you. Uh, ah, the Overwatch thing. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, she is a professional gamer. Oh, that was the only one I thought. That just seems too stupid. Apparently. Yeah, well, that's kind of why I went with that one because I was like, "Well, it's a game. Is that a thing? Yeah, a game within a game. Is that what they're trying to do here?" Must have been. Yeah, but Metroid question. We quickest answer you gave. I'm yeah, right. you know this is correct anyway, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, this yes. one was quite easy for me because I knew it wasn't Solid Snake or Sephiroth, so I just had a 50-50 <laughs> guess and happened to guess correctly. Well, it wasn't Solid and it wasn't Snake <laughs> for a start. No, <laughs> I know then. That's from not. Metal Gear Solid and yeah. Call of Duty. No, 
Well, no, Solid Snake is one person. Oh, okay, cool. Snake! And Sephiroth is in Final Fantasy VII. Oh, there you go. So you had a 50-50. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, it's a pretty easy guess for me. And the Super Mario question. Okay. It is, of course, Shigeru Miyamoto. Yes, good. <laughs> you were never going to get that one wrong. You know when you think of Five something of every ten. day and then you start to question it when you're asked about it? <laughs> yeah. It's like, are you breathing today? Oh, God, am I? Hang on. Um, <laughs> oh, let me just check. Yeah. Hang yeah. on. Let me, let me ask Alexa. Alexa, am I breathing today? <laughs> I hadn't purposely <laughs> thought of who created Mario for some time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm yeah, right five that. out of ten. Five out of ten. Okay. Well, to be honest, if you'd have known about the Uncharted developers, that yeah. would have been one. And you even corrected yourself <sighs> after the fact for the Power Stars. Stupid. So it's kind of nearly seven. Stupid. Stupid. Stupid boy. What I am. Stupid. Right. Stupid. Stupid. I was thinking because I, I I I can't remember exactly, but I think they slightly redid the 64 version for DS or something along those lines, and there was 150, and I got confused. Oh uh, right, they kind of added an extra couple of worlds in or something. Yeah, I just uh, I don't know. Oh well. Yeah. What's yeah, done is done. done. <laughs> it is. I'll take 50 percent. Yeah, well, it was kind of nearly 70 percent. Yeah. I'll take Roughly. unofficial 50%. <laughs> we'll, yeah, we'll split the difference and say 60. <laughs> Yay, that's what I said at the beginning. <laughs> All right, then. What do you think? <laughs> yeah, so that, that's me. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you, for you just whatever website that was that I stole that from. That's <laughs> <laughs> right, one day I'll come up with a Pokemon quiz. <laughs> oh, that'll be fantastic. And I won't know any of the questions or answers that I'm asking. That could be funny. Actually, it doing a quiz be, for yeah. each other that the quiz master doesn't know what they're doing. There's got no idea what the questions are. You know yeah, what? Maybe that could be genuinely quite interesting. <laughs> yeah, maybe we could do. Yeah, all right. We'll keep that one on the back burner. That's a good idea. Yes, yes, indeed. Yeah. Maybe we, if we get to a year. Yeah. Have we already been. I can't remember how long we've been doing these for. I can't remember <laughs> what one this is. Twenty six, I suppose, will be the year. I. Th- think it, this is 21 right okay i think yeah okay then yeah i guess the people watching this already know because it'll say in the thumbnail and the name <laughs> probably and we're just gonna sound completely <laughs> stupid like oh what stupid. are we on yeah what is it <laughs> what have we done yeah. well yeah yeah the last one we did podisode 20 there we go yeah podisode 21 hey, okay, 21 so this is 21 yay so we're 10 weeks away from our year there you go i think so roughly Unless we've missed some. Yeah, I don't think so. I think we've been quite bang on, actually. We might have done around Christmas and New Year. Yeah. But I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. Oh, well, who cares? I'll look check. at the exact date the first one went on and we'll figure it out. We'll work it out from there. Yeah. Okie dokie. All right, then. Well, for this pod, pod is so, pod is so 21, <laughs> yes. uh, I will say goodbye and uh, check how this download is doing and possibly play a demo. Good call. Yeah. Okie dokie. All right. Until the next time, I shall speak to you. Yeah, must be. Yeah. Bye. (laughs) (laughs) Bye bye. Bye.